to me the letter that you got. What is it? The one that you, I just saw. Oh, the letter there? That was from Chesapeake Appalachia soliciting me to lease my property at a certain price. And that would be. And why? you have a copy for of that. What? Well, for the, uh, I guess, uh, for hydrofracking. Apparently, you know, that, that, that's what Chesapeake Appalachian does. It's my understanding. They might be into other things. I'm not sure. Satellite communications, I don't know. But anyway, it was to, you know, use my property here at the corner of Casman Run and Route 67, I think it is, you know, as a uh, the frack. They tell me that I have 100% of oil and gas. I own the mineral rights. I didn't reply. I got another letter, you know, as a follow-up from landsman John Phil Ferries. Professional landman. I thought, wow, what a title. <laughs> well, I could become a professional something like that too. Just put it at the bottom of my name, great. So you're not gonna sign? No, absolutely not. It might be a bargaining chip here so that I'm trying you know, release my property to Bethany College, which is what I would rather do. But really all I wanna do is have a right to that property, to enter that property so that we can test the water that's down below us and what effect maybe the uh, fracking industry is having on the, our aquifer or drinking water. That's w really, that's all I want from, I've leased this property since 1988. It's 2013, coming up on it, right? End of 2012. How many years is that, 24 at this point? Something like that? And add a pittance, $100 a month. So just to get their attention, you know, I'm up in the, uh, up in the price a little bit. The college doesn't want to play apparently. So they send another man down here who can't represent the college. I'm here today to go over to Lease. I grew up here, you know, my high school years. It's a beautiful place, small college community, and it will have an impact environmentally as well as the health values, you know, of the people that live in this area. So we have environmental and public health. It, it's damaging. It's my understanding. I've seen some fracking wells, and I've been watching you know, on the internet and the news about the environmental and the public health doesn't seem good. I don't want that to happen here. This is a home place.